This is a very high profile case in District Attorney. Carmack Altwe says it will be an expensive case that taxpayers will need to cover. Yeah, in fact, she had already made her case for multiple requests for additional funding help. Yeah, Spencer Schott is following the money here. Spencer, what do we know? Well, Ryan, she originally asked the State Board of Finance for $635,000 back, back in September. In her letter to the board, she said, quote, I do not have the proper funding in my budget to prosecute such a high-profile case. She went on to say, my goal and job are to handle this matter to the best of my ability, using every resource possible to obtain justice for the victims and their families in the matter. In the end, she only got half of what she asked for, just over $317,000. But she plans to get the other half from the state legislature. We got an update as to why they need so much money during the interview with the DA today. This is a very wealthy out-of-towner that's going to have a, a slew of lawyers from New York, from Los Angeles. Um, there are multiple co-defendants, although one did take a plea. Um, and it's, it's an industry that we are going to need to hire experts for. And experts are very expensive in, in trials. And so we are going to need to harness a lot of resources in order to prosecute this case. And the special prosecutor in this case, Andrea Reeb, is also serving as a state legislator at, as a state representative. And she told our team today that she will recuse herself from any vote involving this request for funding. Back to you.